वट इज द डिफरेंस बिटवीन प्रिमेटिव एंड नॉन प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप्स वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट क्वेश्चन हेयर इज द लिस्ट ऑफ डेटा टाइप्स इन जावा स्क्रिप्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल प्रिमेटिव एंड नॉन प्रिमेटिव आर द कैटेगरीज ऑफ डेटा टाइप्स द एक्चुअल डेटा टाइप्स आर नंबर स्ट्रिंग बुलियन अनडिफाइंड एक्सेट्रा विच कम्स अंडर प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप्स सिमिलरली ऑब्जेक्ट एरे फंक्शन डेट एंड रेजेक्स आर द डेटा टाइप्स दैट फॉल अंडर द नॉन प्रिमेटिव कैटेगरी दीज टू कैटेगरीज वर क्रिएटेड बिकॉज दे हैव सम फंडामेंटल डिफरेंसेज लेट्स टॉक अबाउट प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप्स फर्स्ट एंड हेयर इज वन प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप नंबर द फर्स्ट पॉइंट अबाउट प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप इज प्रिमेटिव डेटा टाइप्स कैन होल्ड ओनली ए सिंगल वैल्यू विच इज वाई वी ऑल्सो कॉल दैम सिंपल डेटा टाइप्स द सेकेंड पॉइंट अबाउट दैम इज primitive data types are immutable meaning their values one assigned once assigned cannot be changed for example if you change the value of a number which is a primitive data type like this we assigned a new value to age then from outside it looks like the variable value is modified but internally a new vari variable age is created by the memory of the javascript and assigned a new value to it what happen actually is for example this is the memory managed by the javascript engine inside the browser when a new age variable is created for the first time a new memory is echo occupied by this variable and the value is stored there in the memory address but when the variable value is updated or modified to suppose 30 then again a new memory is assigned with a new address like this and now the variable age age is assigned to this new memory address with a new value great right so that's why numbers string and all primitive data types are immutable because their values are never changed a uh, immutable english meaning is a thing that cannot be changed or modified right all right this is all about primitive data types now let's check out non primitive data types and here is our first non primitive data type which is an array and here is one another one which is an object i will come cover them in detail later but here you can identify the first point about non primitive data types non primitive data types can hold multiple values and second point they are mutable and their values can be changed so if you modify this 3 to 4 in the same array then it can be done in the same memory at the same location or at the same address great now let's conclude the differences between them the first difference is uh, numbers string booleans non defined uh, null are primitive data types and objects arrays functions dates and regex are non primitive data types second primitive data types can hold only single value whereas non primitive data types can hold multiple values and methods also the third difference is primitive data types are immutable and their values cannot be changed whereas non primitive data types are mutable and their values can be changed and the last difference is primitive data types are simple data types whereas non primitive data types are called complex data types why because they can hold a list of students single values function arrays anything they can hold that's make them complex great now you are not going to forget this uh, two differences between them ever